E pessoas, beleza? Estou aqui gravando mais um vídeo de Batman da Telltale E bora lá então estar curtindo nossa campanha do início então ao capítulo 6 e capítulo final do episódio 3 Então bora lá Stay here, okay? Just don't move. Thank you, Selena. Don't thank me yet. <sighs> Shit. You're lucky you were wearing that suit. You know that was stupid, right? Uh, what? Showing up at that train depot. Taking on their leader alone. Repeat after me, Bruce. I am not invincible, and painkillers do not solve the problem. You weren't gonna take them down on your own. <laughs> You're one to talk. <laughs> I never pick a fight I can't win. I don't think you're getting very far with a shoulder like this. Oh, great. You can stay here until morning. I feel like I owe you anyway. That's twice now. You just keep adding things to my list, don't you? Selena. I told you I don't like owing people. Probably best to lie low for now anyway. I don't want the children of Arkham finding this place. I had it handled, you know. With their leader. I had a plan. Really didn't need you swooping in and messing it up. I wasn't there to save you. I thought you'd gone back over to their side. You thought you were gonna take me out, did you? Well, if I had to. Good luck. That was gonna be my ticket out of here. One last job to get the goons off my back. So much for that. Thanks again, Bats. <sighs> I'm sorry I messed things up for you back there. I know. I'm used to it anyway. There's no such thing as a fresh start. Oh, look who's back. Hey, little one. I don't think she likes you. <laughs> okay, she really doesn't like you. Yeah, well, you've got most of Gotham behind you on that. Well, not most. Maybe half. Just trying to be optimistic. T cut it out. This really hasn't been your week, has it? <laughs> you think? I lost my company, my reputation, and I find out my father was... Just like everyone else. They've all got something to hide, Bruce. Every last one of them. Even the so-called good guys. There's always something. I'm starting to see that for myself. Even you have your secrets. Those things you hide from the world. And won't let anyone else see. I don't have any secrets from you. You know, I have heard that a thousand times. But you might be the first to actually mean it. You're a good man, Bruce. But good men don't lie with thieves. I know what I am. No noble intentions. Just the thrill of breaking what they say can't be broken. Knowing there's no safe I can't crack. No fortress I can't infiltrate. That's not all you are. I think that's just what you want people to believe. You put a lot of faith in someone who doesn't deserve it. I've stolen from corrupt jerks like Hill, but... I've taken plenty from good people, too. But for what? Some shiny new toys in a crappy apartment on the edge of town? The high is nice, but it wears off. Then you look around and see... 
Nothing. So you get back out there. Try and chase that feeling down. You're not alone, okay? I'm here for you. Thanks, Bats. Hmm. I was hoping for something more than that. Do I have to do all the work myself? Or are you gonna undo this for me? Let me help you. Mm. It's what you do best, isn't it? Are you trying to tease me, Bats? Is it working? Hey there. I'm starving. Well, I guess that means I'm making breakfast. Wow. You even know how to work a toaster, rich kid? I am offended. Oh, too bad. I think there might be bagels in the fridge. We definitely check expiration dates on anything. Before you think about putting it in your mouth. Eita, tá pitando. Oh, aí. Bruce? Morning, Alfred. Oh, thank goodness. I was worried. I hadn't heard from you. I didn't know what happened if, if you were. I am an adult, Alfred. You don't have to keep tabs on me 24-7. Well, when your job involves fighting masked villains at two in the morning, then yes. I think I do. <sighs> I always fear the day you don't come home, Bruce. I know, Al. Where are you, anyway? I, uh... I stayed at Selena's last night. Oh. Well, that certainly explains it. You got something to say, Alfred? I'm not judging you. Sounded like you were. I wouldn't dream of it. While you're there, this might be a good opportunity to learn more about Miss Kyle. After all, we really don't know anything about her. See what you can find lying around. If she's trustworthy, you may not have another chance. I trust her, Alfred. That's all I need to know. If you're sure, at the very least, you can find that grapple gun of yours. Right. That might be harder than you'd think. She doesn't share your love of organization. Yes, well, I'll see you back at home, Bruce. Dispositivo de garra. Pretty strong magnets on these things. Very lightweight, though. We could use something like this. Scarlet Pimpernel, much ado about nothing. Petrarca. <laughs> Didn't take her for a romantic. What's this one? Oh, the Gita Govinda. That's academic. 
Tá, não sei se eu pego, né? Não tem por que eu pegar. She can afford to eat coisa. anywhere, and she still chooses Chinese takeout. That isn't even a good place. This was an exhibit at the Gotham Museum of Art. I helped raise the funds for it. Lucius even set up new security for the museum. How did she get in? Her cat eats like a queen while she's eating junk. There you are. Uh, I hope she didn't break anything. <sighs> Vacation spots are just marks on her burglary checklist. Looks all right to me. Nothing growing, at least. At least she's got the essentials. Ah. Harvey. Hey. I, uh, I brought breakfast. C can I come in? I don't know if that's such a good idea. Just for a minute. I really need to talk to you. If you want me to go, I'll go. But I have to get this out. Food. Bruce, what the... Uh, uh, what are you doing here? Have a seat, Harvey. No! I don't need to sit down. I just came by to check on Selena. What, with your pants off? Back off, Harvey. Don't! Don't touch me! I thought I would come here and... So stupid! God, I should have known. I should have known that you would do this to me. None of it was real anyway. God, how could you ever think it was? None of this is about you, Harvey. It's... I'm just making this up? Yes, you are. This had nothing to do with you. He... He will not be able to protect you. And I don't need him to. Just get out of here, Harvey. What happens when the children of Arkham come for him? You think you won't get caught in the crossfire? You can't stop them. He can't. I may go down for what my father did, but I won't take her down with me. She'll be fine. Ah, oh, funny. Thinking you have a choice. Thinking you can save the people around you. Thinking you could do what Harvey couldn't! I'm sorry. What the hell is going on with you? Up until now, Harvey has been weak. He's been afraid. Oh my god. This... This is the monster they all know that you are. Embrace it! No! No! Oh god, this is what you wanted to see, isn't it, huh? The freak! Harvey. All right, now you've got two seconds. Or what? Harvey won't be pushed around anymore. No, he's gonna make them pay. Everyone who thought they could hurt him and get away with it. Starting with you. Both of you! You're gonna pick that up. Oh, am I? Yes, you are. This isn't... You just calm down! Shut up! Jesus, Harvey. Of course, gotta be fair about this. Can't play favorites. They both deserve it, one way or another. Uh, how about we flip for it? This isn't funny. No, no, it really isn't. You're first. Selena. No! I don't want to hurt you. This isn't... They turned their backs on you! 
Buffy, put the knife down. <sighs> Selena! <sighs> He's gonna hurt someone. You know we can take him out. <clears throat> Have you lost your mind? No. Last warning, Harvey. You walk out that door right now and I don't have to hurt you. No going back now. Finally showing your true colors, huh? Deixar encher já a barra aqui rápido. Oh, Bruce. <laughs> Please, not with him. But I can't. Oh, God, I can't listen to him. You need to get help. You can't deal with this on your own. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I, I know, I know. My fault. Harvey, don't. Bruce, I... I don't think we can help him. Not on our own. He's my friend, Selena. I'm not going to abandon him. He needs professional help. Help you can't give him. It's okay, Bruce. I'll go. I don't deserve your help. Go off with your tail between your legs. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Harvey! <sighs> so much for this place. I'm not gonna stick around and wait for him to come back. I thought it would be a while before I had to move again. That's what I get for wishful thinking. Yeah, you're right. It's not safe to stay here. And I'm not sure I'm gonna find another place with this kind of private access. Ugh. Maybe I'll live on a boat. <laughs> Kidding. Yeah, that means you too. We won't go far. Don't worry. You should come stay with me. Uh, I don't know. There's plenty of space. Alfred could set up a guest room for you. I'll think about it. Great. What was that about? I'm supposed to announce my resignation at a press event today. Somehow try to appear happy that Oswald Cobblepot is taking my job. Sounds like an opportunity. How do you mean? They screwed you out of your own company. You have all this information that could bring them down, and they're handing you a live mic. So use it. Don't be their puppet. Maybe you're right. This could be my chance to expose Oswald for who he really is. Let Gotham know he's a part of the children of Arkham. Exactly. You better get going. I've got some packing to do. The offer still stands. Sounding better and better by the minute. I'm sorry about all this, Bruce. We've... Uh, we've prepared a brief damage control statement to make this easier. After I introduce you, all you'll have to do is read what's on the teleprompter. And then I can take it from there. Got my little coronation speech just waiting. Thank you for being so cooperative about all this, Bruce. It really is for the best. For everyone, really. I know it's unfair to ask this of you, but please. Right now, your reputation, your entire legacy, depends on your cooperation. Get through today, and I can help you. I can convince the board to bring you back. It might not be CEO, but it will be something. A step to regaining what you're being forced to give up. I haven't had a say in any of this, and you expect me to cooperate? I won't do it. This is about more than just your ego, Bruce. It's in everyone's best interest for you to gracefully step down. 
All ready then. We are going to make quite a splash today, aren't we? I don't think I'm ever going to forget this day. Beautiful weather, corporate intrigue, a well-deserved comeuppance. Oh, don't worry, Oz. I'll make sure you remember every moment. Meaning? That's enough, both of you. It's time. Bruce, I'm going to introduce you and then you're on. Please, stick to the teleprompter. Good morning, everyone, and thank you for being here. Wayne Enterprises has always taken its role in the community very seriously. Isn't it funny? And we've all How everything I said to you in the park has come true. Me, and taking everything that's yours. And that's not even a punchline. Oh dear, over two not even close. We have no one's going to follow you around and take pictures now. It'd almost be sad if you were so bloody handsome. I know who you really are, Oz. And I'm going to expose you. Oh, knowing and proving are two very different things, Bruce. This is just a first step towards making things right. Soon enough, it'll be Cobblepot Industries, Cobblepot Medical, and Cobblepot Tech on tops of buildings, and you, Waynes, will be what you should have been all along. A forgotten footnote. Cobblepot will come to mean the future of Gotham. And Wayne will be a story no one wants to hear. What happens to my company is up to the board. I think you're a little deluded about the type of power you're gonna have. All in good time, all in good time. It's amazing the sort of patience I've developed over the years. Oh, I forgot to mention, I did some digging, and you know how old Hill admitted he had your mom and dad killed? I found out why he did it. Oh yeah, and I'll tell you the story, but only if you say, pretty please. It's quite the page, Turner. I'm sure you're just dying to hear it. I don't need to know why. Hill had them killed. That's all that matters. Well, I certainly didn't expect that. But suit yourself. Now you'll never know what part your mum played in it. And now, Bruce Wayne would like to say a few words. Remember, enjoy yourself, Bruce. After all, you never know how much time you really have left. <sighs> Senhoras e senhores, a luz das recentes ou estão forçando a mentir, isso não é voluntário. I'm stepping down from my position as CEO of Wayne Enterprises, but I am not doing so voluntarily. The board of Wayne Enterprises has voted me out. At a meeting, I was not invited to attend. My father wasn't the only one involved in this corruption. Mayor Hill and Carmine Falcone. It was a system designed for their gain. Dodging the blame isn't gonna do you any good, mate. Security! Step back, Mr. Wayne. Oh, that was quite a show you put on, Bruce. <clears throat> My apologies, folks. Please forgive me, Mr. Wayne. Everyone. I, for one, completely understand his behavior today. Nice After statement. All, he is the press seemed to eat it up. I rather enjoyed it myself. Not that it'll change anything. I did what I felt was right. So yeah, well, someone has to. I just didn't think it'd be you. It's not an easy thing, seeing something you've come to have as part of your identity. Dropped your pen. That's not... I should know. I'm sure some of you remember the formal beauty of Cobb. You feel that? Now That's the drug taking hold of you. How could you? Retribution, Bruce. We've all recently learned. I think it's time you knew my real name. I am Wendy Barker. And you already know the penguin. Look at him up there, taking everything that should belong to you. Mocking you, a smug, insignificant bastard. He thinks he can get away with it, because none of them know who he really is. They wouldn't believe you if you told them. And if we could just get one more round of applause for our friend, the man of the hour, Bruce Wayne! <sighs> oh, 
Ouch! Someone's a little touchy, it seems. It would be so easy to get rid of him. Who else will deliver justice? E completamos aqui o capítulo 3, né? Episódio 3, Nova Ordem Mundial. Caraca, mano, que incrível. Você ajudou o, a Montoya, ou o Prefeito Dente. Você e 39% de jogadores optaram por ajudar Harvey e deixar Montoya encarar o perigo sozinha. E 60% ajudaram o, ela primeiro, né? Você socou o Oswald. Você e 68% de jogadores não tiveram compostura quando provocados pelo Oswald. E 32% socou ele. Você pediu a Lucius para ficar na empresa Wayne ou para trabalhar por você? Você, 65% dos jogadores optaram por Lucius ficar na empresa Wayne. E 34% pediram para ele ficar, uh, trabalhar no, com ele, né? com o Bruce. Você teve um romance com Selina? Você, 90% dos jogadores passaram a noite com Selina e 10% não. Você bateu no Harvey ou pegou leve com ele? Você e 15% de jogadores provo foram provocados a ponto de agredir fisicamente o Harvey e 84% de jogadores não agrediram ele. E é isso, né? Vamos ver o que vai acontecer agora, né? After his shocking and atrocious display of violence towards Oswald Cobblepot and members of the press, Bruce Wayne has demonstrated a clear lack of mental stability. That's why, effective immediately, I have signed the order to have him hospitalized in Arkham Asylum. Batman, the children of Arkham, the Penguin. Doesn't Gotham already have enough deranged criminals terrorizing its streets? I believe that Gotham's citizens deserve to be safe, that they deserve to be protected. Even if that means I have to do it myself. With, with the children of Arkham out in full force, we need him now more than ever. Where is Batman? E é isso então, concluímos aqui então o episódio 3, então é isso, eu vou encerrar o vídeo por aqui já, então no próximo vídeo a gente continua com o episódio 4, então, pessoas, se vocês gostaram do vídeo, né, cliquem em gostei dos seus favoritos, compartilhem seus redes sociais para ajudar na divulgação do canal Sator e tal, é, deixe um comentário abaixo também se daí, se inscrevam no canal também, e também não se esqueça de ativar o sininho para receber notificações de quando sair o vídeo novo aqui do canal, então pessoas, até a próxima, falou! Selina doesn't like to be a boy. After shut up, Papa. Deal. I'm gonna get you somewhere safe. Just stay with me. <laughs>